गाइज वॉट्स आप इच रिया एंड वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल सो इन टूडेज वीडियो आम कन बी डिस्कसिंग विद यू फाइव डेंजरस केमिकल्स दैर आर सुपर हार्मफुल फॉर योर बॉडी विच आर यूज बाई स्किन केयर एंड मेकअप ब्रांड्स आई ऑलरेडी हैव अ पार्ट वन ऑफ दिस वीडियो विच आम गन लीव लिंक इन द बॉटम बार्स इन केस इफ यू वॉन्ट टू चेक दैट आउट सो बिफोर आई बिगिन विद द वीडियो आई जिस वन गिव यू अ लिल बेट ऑफ इन्फॉर्मेशन देर आर टू टाइप्स ऑफ केमिकल्स गुड केमिकल्स एंड बैड केमिकल्स सो सम ऑफ दीज ब्रांड्स सम ऑफ दीज कंपनीज यूज बैड केमिकल्स इन देअर प्रोडक्ट्स विच वेन वी यूज डैमेज इज आर स्किन एंड आर बॉडी इन सो मेनी वेज दैट वी डोंट इवन नो सो इट्स हाई टाइम वी कॉल आउट दीज ब्रांड्स कॉल आउट दीज प्रोडक्ट्स एंड पॉइंट आउट दीज हार्मफुल इनग्रीडियंट्स सो दैट दीज ब्रांड्स स्टॉप यूजिंग दैम इन देअर प्रोडक्ट्स एंड स्विच टू गुड केमिकल्स एंड ऑल्सो आई एम गोन बी शेयरिंग विद यू अ फ्यू ब्रांड नेम्स एंड अ फ्यू प्रोडक्ट्स दैट डू not contain bad chemicals but are filled with good quality chemicals so without any further ado let's quickly begin with today's video so dangerous chemical number 1 is petroleum jelly you will find it in most of the moisturizers petroleum jelly is contaminated with so many impurities which can lead to skin cancer skin allergies and even acne petroleum jelly is supposed to hydrate and moisturize your skin and it is found in so many different forms if you read the ingredient list of the product you will find petroleum jelly in the form of petroleum mineral oil petroleum jelly paraffin wax etc so these are a few forms of petroleum jelly and you should be avoiding this ingredient at every cost especially if you have sensitive skin or acne prone skin this is one ingredient that actually causes a lot of acne so when people tell me that you know you can use uh, vaseline petroleum jelly as a highlighter well do not do that if you have acne prone skin it just leads to breakout i've done it i know it and that's why i'm warning you all not to do that Instead of using petroleum jelly as the ingredient for hydration, companies can also opt for uh, ingredients like hyaluronic acid, which also provides hydration to your skin. But somehow, companies still use petroleum jelly into their products because it is a very cheap and inexpensive chemical. Number two on the harmful chemical list is SLES. SLES is a foaming agent which is used in shampoos, body washes, soaps, etc. Sometimes you will also find this ingredient in toothpaste. SLES can cause various types of skin allergies and skin irritations and it dries out your skin and your scalp so badly it is the worst foaming agent which is used in skincare and hair care products and it can damage your skin and your hair so you need to avoid using products that contain SLS and instead switch to products which do not contain SLS as the foaming agent but other better chemicals a few examples of hair care and skin care brands that do not contain SLS are wow and body cupid they have so many shampoos and body washes which is free from SLS SLS free products do not foam up a lot but they foam up just the right amount to clean your scalp and your body number 3 on the dangerous chemical list is alcohol now let me make one thing clear not all types of alcohol are bad for your skin use of drying alcohols on a temporary basis can actually give you good and fast results and that's why it's not considered as a harmful uh, thing for your skin but use of alcohol for a prolonged period of time can actually Leave your skin very dry and flaky because it kind of eats away the surface of the skin and it causes a lot of unnecessary stress on your skin, which then results in interruption in your skin renewal cycle, which in turn damages your skin really badly. So prolonged use of alcohol in skincare and makeup products can make your skin condition really unhealthy. Um, alcohol is mainly found in toners, but I have a few examples of brands which have alcohol-free toners. So number one on my list is Plum Green Tea Toner. This is free from alcohol. A uh, Himalaya Refreshing and Clarifying Toner is also free from alcohol, but it is not suitable for um, sensitive and acne-prone skin. So I just wanted to mention that. Um, Biotic Cucumber Pore Tightening Toner. Biotic Honey Water Toner. Aroma Magic Aromatic Skin Toner. Kaya Daily. for minimizing toner are some examples of alcohol free toners number 4 on my harmful chemical list is mineral oil now mineral oil is a by product of petroleum jelly uh, mineral oil coats your skin like plastic thereby giving you that shine and that moisture sort of an effect but actually it's doing nothing but clogging your pores mineral oil is extremely harmful for your skin because it doesn't let your skin eliminate the toxins out which further leads to acne and other skin disorders so you need to avoid mineral oil especially in your skincare products some brands which have products which are free from mineral oil are wow 
Mama Earth, Plum, etc. And finally, number five on my harmful chemical list is synthetic colors. Now, synthetic products also come from petroleum and tar sources, and they are extremely harmful for your skin. Overuse of products which contain synthetic colors can cause various skin disorders and even lead to cancer. Now, companies are really smart, and they do not reveal in the ingredient list what kind of chemicals they have used to form that synthetic color of your particular product. So to identify the chemicals that have been used in a particular product to form that kind of a uh, color, you can check the ingredient list and you will find the words FDNC or DNC combined with a number. So you can Google it and check what kind of chemicals they have used to form that particular color and how harmful or how bad those chemicals are for your skin, for your hair and for your body. Now there are certain brands which have certain products which are free from uh, synthetic colors. Some examples are Wow, Mama Earth. They do have a few products uh, which do not contain any synthetic colors and that is the best part because let's face it, you don't use a particular skincare or a particular hair care product just for the color. You might use it for the fragrance, you might use it for what it does to your skin, for your hair. You use it for the benefits of the product, you don't use it for the color, right? So synthetic color has absolutely no use in a product, it has no benefits, but in turn, it only harms your skin and your hair. So you need to stop using products which contain synthetic colors and companies need to stop making products with synthetic colors. So that was my part two of five harmful and dangerous chemicals that skincare and makeup brands use in their products. Uh, if you want to see a uh, part 3 of this video, do comment down below and I shall make it for you all. Also, if you have any other video suggestions in mind, then do let me know that as well in the comment section below. And if you found this video helpful and informative, then please hit the like button. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and follow me on my Instagram handle. The direct link will be mentioned in the bottom bar so you can check that out. And yeah, that's a wrap for now. I shall see you super soon.